the worst category and the last category is someone who's in uh, a marriage so a husband right who is paying someone that's doing this on the sly with a second phone mm. why do you think people are doing what why do you think that category is doing it he's neglected from his wife you think so yeah there's an element of neglect and this is something that women get really offended when i tell them this but the reality is men are babies yeah they really are just babies now when um when the wife and this is no this is not her fault but when you have kids with women when they naturally have kids and all of these things they are designed to just focus on the children is how we're designed biologically we have the hormones we have the obsession we get so much oxytocin from just kissing that child what happens then is she doesn't even see her husband anymore so he comes into his home and almost feels like a stranger in his own home because it's like mom and baby they're so connected baby's always a bit like connected to mom she can't switch off he'll go for dinner with his wife and she's thinking about the baby 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 slowly that that husband feels more and more neglected and what happens then is because it's so weird to say to your wife why are you always with the baby can you give me a kiss instead it's such a weird conversation to have so what they end up doing is seeking that attention elsewhere now it's not all men some men dive into the parenthood with their wife they hold their hand the wife's hand and go straight into the ch- children but other men especially if they didn't receive a lot of love growing up they need that personalized attention So when they're not getting it from their partner instead of communicating it, they go source it somewhere else. That's super interesting. It's weird to see him go that far and that extreme. Yeah, you know? well, it depends what kind of husband you have. Some men really do just like my dad was like this. He was very involved in the kids. So he would not care that she's not my mum's not really paid him much attention and stuff. But other men I have uncles like this where they really seek attention from their wife and they get like play with me, be with me kind of vibe and um so I, everybody's different but it does depend on their level of self-esteem and their pre-existing trauma. Here's the thing there's so much talk about the only fans girl and how emotionally broken she must be and this that and the other but the reality is there's a at least she's getting a perk she can literally cl- change her legacy she might have grown up in a council estate and now can pay off her parents house and she can start that so of course emotional there, there's damage but she can be like it was worth it whatever she can have some self esteem attached to it the man that's paying for it there's nothing to gain from it nothing but loss of self respect old girl send a nude to another 12 13 or 15 year old boy uh, because they're growing up with role models who post on only fans they're growing up being told that you don't actually need an education you can make $50,000 a month if you just post the right pictures online so when you are told that and you are bored to death in a maths class and you're being told to learn uh, like a uh, you know about parameters on the rectangle that you don't care about or you can see a really sexy girl talk about how much money she's making where is a child going to go particularly when they're not raised in a home or environment which boosts their self-esteem and uh, emphasizes internal morals so wh- why are our children going to go it's not their fault at all it's the society we've created and what we've glamorized and highlighted for children. I think the rise in bisexuality in women is predominantly from exposure to porn. I what I find really difficult about pornography and really disempowering is the majority of the time that women are watching it, they're doing it for their partner's pleasure, very limited for their own. So they're watching girl on girl and they're watching the things on that and they're engaging on that behavior so they're almost catering to the male gaze in a way that's helping them lose their own identity. They're signing up for degradation. They're signing up for confused sexual identity. They're signing up for a society that only caters to male sexual gratification. So I find it more bizarre that women watch porn.